Today, I will be hopping into Spike Rush games and asking Valorant players deep questions. Let's get into it. Hey, Killjoy, I have a question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going around asking people uh, some questions. What is something that you want to teach the next generation? To be kind. Aw, I like that. We should all uh, be supportive and kind to each other. I think uh, as a society, would be, we would be in a better place. One and if we can out. learn that from the very beginning, I think it would be very beneficial for everyone. Here. I agree with that 100%. Hey, uh, I have a question for anyone who wants to answer. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm just going around asking random people questions. Yes. Do you have a bad rejection Where story? I? Okay, I wouldn't call it a rejection story, but do you want a funny story that's not that? Yeah, sure, I'll take that. Reloading. All right, I was camping with my best friend when I was like 16. And, uh, where we go camping, um, there's like this thing you can go around, like there's like a cement thing around the entire thing that like a lot of people like, you know, like go walk or ride bikes or skateboards around it and stuff. And we were going around and there was just two girls our age. And then we kept going around and like, you know, we were there for a few days and then we started walking like together with them. And I asked for both their numbers. Like I wasn't just gonna about ask for one, like not on like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, you're still falling, okay, yeah. And, uh, so I got it mixed up because because at the time my best friend like, I don't know what happened I don't think he didn't not, either didn't have a phone or his broke or something so he was using mine like uh, sometimes and I got the numbers mixed up so I thought I was talking to one and then one of them like after talking for like a week or two and like they live like an hour or like 30 minutes away like you know like because we were camping far away uh -huh. but uh but where we actually live like they were kind of close you know and. I may or may not have when she asked me, like, do you, do you even like know which one I am? Like, she wanted to make sure. And I said, yeah, the shorter, prettier one. And I had the wrong number. Oh, and... brother, that's bad. <laughs> do you think you recovered well or no? Dude, do I think I recovered well? Yeah, after after you sent that text. Oh, no, it was completely over. <laughs> okay, I can have a second question, second question. What is your biggest regret if you have one? Not being born white. <laughs> That's tough. I should have tried harder in the womb. Sorry. <laughs> What's your best rejection story? Ooh. That's a good question. Let me think. Any deals? Hmm. I actually haven't thought about this myself. You know what? I do have one big regret. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to say it or is it going <laughs> to... Oh, you want to hear it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd probably say not telling my friend I loved him when he called me Christmas like three years ago. Then he well, passed away like six now? months later. Uh -oh. I'm sorry, dude. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shoot, like a million bullets a minute. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, I, th I, th I thought we had one more round. GG's. Oh, GG's. I love you all. You're my favorite. Add me if you want. They were all chill dudes. Okay, uh, I have a question. I asked, I'm going around uh -huh. asking people some questions. Are you chill with that? Go for it. Okay, ready? I This one is more of like a philosophical one. Does money buy happiness? It buys hookers and blow. <laughs> Fair. Okay, I have another question. When was one time someone betrayed you? Uh, when they got rid of the Choco Taco. Oh, dude, Choco Tacos are fire. I want to ask him one that he can't turn into a joke. What's the next one? Hit me with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, which parent are you closer to and why? They're both dead. So, I mean, technically, whichever one's put on top, I guess. Stop. This dude's got to stop. This dude's got to stop. If there's anyone, what made you cut off a friendship? They were dumb. Toxicity. Spike planted. Uh, like how? One enemy remaining. Also, you don't have to answer. Always causing one. problems. Enemies making it drama. Making you're making okay. everything about themselves. So. Drama. <laughs> yeah, I feel that. Fucking hate drama. <laughs> Fair. Uh, which parent are you closer to, and why? Neither. I'm gonna have to drama. skip this one. Okay. Yeah, no, it's fine. Um, do you guys have a funny rejection story or like a worst rejection story? Standing ahead. I'm a gamer. Yeah, I don't talk to girls. 
I've only ever asked one girl out and we're currently dating, so oh, I don't big know what to w. tell you. Nice, dude. Spike planted. You take last those. Okay. Can can love really last a lifetime? I'll tell you at the end of my life. Okay, good answer. No. No, really. No. Why is that? I feel like it's probably it's really rare. Hit. Yeah. If but it, it is, is it, if it can happen, it's very, very, very rare. Uh, so next question. Does money buy happiness? Last player standing. If you buy a lot of drugs, yeah. <laughs> Why is that always the answer? I don't think it always does, but it depends on where you are in life. Like right now, I'm unhappy because I don't have money. If I had money, I'd probably be a lot happy. Thank you all for watching. Um, make sure you watch my next video or subscribe. And I, if you don't, I swear to God, I'll come to your house and I'll beat you up and you're never going to see the light of day again. Love you. <laughs>